Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing the series finale of Voltron Legendary Defender and it's called The End of is the Beginning. So we start off with um, Atlas Voltron versus Anerva. And so Anerva goes to another reality and uh, so AV follows, I assume as abbreviation. So, and they're at the beginning and the end of the universe, basically. It's like, um, it's like a big spider web, but in the center it's like the void of where things starts. And, which is like the beginning and the end. So, Adurva is basically off in all the reality. She's like, if I can't be in any reality, I'm destroying all reality. I was like, you okay? <laughs> And um, basically they do a face-off and then uh, Voltron Atlas uh, basically levels up again. It has like these uh, mecha wings and they go into the void which is slash the consciousness of the universe. And so they basically just have it out like, girl, like, what's your deal basically? <laughs> like, why are you doing this? And she's basically like, she feels guilty that she wasn't really there for Lotor when he was growing up because she was all crazy and cuckoo pants because of the quintessence and stuff. And so, um, she's just a very, very bitter, bitter, bitter person. So, Allura tries to make her see reason and she finally does, but she doesn't know what to do. So, Allura... It's going to sacrifice herself in order to save all of realities, like all the real realities that are destroyed. She wants to help, like, repair it and, like, you know, do what's good for the universe, basically. So, um, she says her goodbyes and basically it hit me all in the fields. The last 10 minutes of the show hit me in the fields on the verge of, like, bawling. And I hadn't cried in years, but I was like, this was getting me good. I mean, they really did a really good ending with this. Anyway, so uh, she, so Allura is greeted by the OG Paladins and Lotor, and then everything is back. But the, uh, the new thing is that Altea is back as well, the actual planet and their reality. So they managed to bring that back, which I thought was really cool. And then we have one year later where basically Keith is like, um, not really an emperor of the Gaara Empire, but like a, uh, counselor almost trying to pick a new, um, leader for the Gaara, but he doesn't want to be leader. He wants, I guess, be like counseling or whatever. Uh, Hunk is basically fixes food, um, for like really fancy people and, and like, uh, does meetings and stuff, which I thought was pretty cool. Uh, Pidge is a creating chip, which is like, um, a, a AI robot. So that's pretty cool for him as well. For her. So just kidding. Um, then we have Lance, um, basically was given the kids on Atea a lesson. Also, when Allura died, her marks underneath her eyes for, like, for Altea, or Alteans got transferred onto him. Forgot to mention that. So basically he's teaching these kids about what she did and, you know, what they did. And, you know, it's like a little lesson. And then he, like, lives on a farm. He's, like, lives, like, a simple life, which I thought was really cool. And, um, it's celebration time with Allura's statue in the background. And they're, like, having, like, a fun time. And then after the celebration, they all get together and just talk a little bit, the, um, paladins. I think Shiro is still with the Atlas and stuff, and I'm pretty, anyway. And then we cut to where um, the blue lion is awake, which was her lion. And then the others do too, and they all war, and they all take off. And then they show like some more pictures of like um, Shiro getting married, and like just everyone kind of growing up a little bit more, which I thought was pretty cool at the end. It was a really, really good ending. I give this episode A+. Plus. It was, honestly, this is probably one of the best series I've watched in a while. 
I really enjoyed every episode. I might just do a little recap things for the first five seasons that I didn't do for this channel because I watched it already. Uh, we'll see, but um, I can worry about that later. I'm trying to watch the stuff that are out now, so that's got a little bit more priority than everything else. So anyway, I, I really enjoyed, like I said, the series. I thought it was really good and very interesting, and I thought it was really good and I really loved it, and I might re-watch everything again <laughs> uh, whenever I have time. But anyway, if that's going to do for this video. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think of the series finale. Do you agree, disagree? What are your thoughts on the season as a whole? Do you, like, just tell me your thoughts down below. I like having conversations with people. And what else? And don't forget to subscribe, because that helps out the channel a lot. And that's it. So I'll see y'all later. And if you want to see other shows that I do, I do other anime. I'm actually redo I'm doing Pokemon right now, the original series. And I also do more adult stuff. I do Daredevil, um, all the Netflix, like, Marvel shows. I also do Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., which I'm going back to as well. And also uh, the Arrowverse for DC and everything. So... If you want to check this out, um, I is, I have it in playlists all on my channel, so just find the playlist and you can enjoy those as well. And I also did like Pretty Little Liars too, but anyway, that's a whole different thing. So anyway, I'll see you on my next video and see y'all later. Bye.